In this video, we're going to look at using the hyperlink function in Google Sheets. The hyperlink function allows you to link your Google Sheet to any other type of Google file, such as a document or another Google Sheet file. It allows you to link to different tabs within the same Google Sheet file. It even allows you to link to a different cell on the same tab of your Google Sheet file. So what you see here is a preview of what we're going to create today. On this first tab called Combined Summary, I have summary data for sales and revenue expenses for three different divisions which are on the next three tabs. I have a East Division, a West Division, and a Central Division and each of these three tabs has data that is specific to each division. And this first tab summarizes the data. To the right here I have hyperlinks that will take me to each divisions tab and within that tab I have links down here that will go to a Google Doc that contains information that is specific to that division such as the supervisor name, that supervisor's phone number and email, the location of the division, and the number of full-time and part-time employees. I also have a link to go back to the summary tab on each of these specific division tab so I can quickly go back. What I also have is a link to go down lower on this same summary sheet so down here I have a chart and I have a link that will take me down to this chart on the same tab and then a link to go back to the top of that same tab. Now it is easy to scroll down obviously but this hyperlink function will come in handy if you have lots of rows and you want to be able to jump around quickly to different areas of the same sheet or you have just tons of different tabs on the same sheet file and you want to be able to quickly jump from tab to tab. So the first thing I want to do is create a hyperlink to our branch tabs from this combined summary tab. So the first thing we want to do here is click on our destination sheet. In this case it's going to be East Division. I'm going to go up to the address bar, highlight this address, hit Control C to copy it. I'm going to go back to the summary tab I'm going to insert the hyperlink function. The first input is the URL. That's going to be the address we just copied of our East Division tab. So this needs to be enclosed in double quotes. So I'm going to begin with an opening double quote. Hit Control V to paste that in there and end it with a double quote. And then the second input of this function is the link label we want to use. It's really up to you but just something that tells users what this link goes to. In this case I'm going to call this East Division Detail. So I can click on this now and it takes us to the East Division data. So now what I want to do is create a link to the Google Doc that contains the branch info like the contact info like the supervisor and all of that. So I want my link to be here so the first thing I'm gonna do is go to that Word doc that I want to link it to. I called it Word doc it's actually a Google doc. So I'm gonna go up to the address bar again hit control C to copy it and just like with the previous example we're gonna insert the hyperlink function put that address in the first argument, the URL. We're going to give it a label of East Division Info. 
now when I click on this it opens up that Google Doc easy enough so now we'll create a link to go back to our combined summary tab so I'm gonna go back to the summary tab click on the address here up top hit control C go back to my East Division tab I'm gonna insert the hyperlink call this back to summary and we're back at the summary so now we want to create a link to a specific cell on the same tab or sheet we want to create a link from the top here to go down to the expense chart that shows our expense allocation of how expenses are being spent so what I want to do to get a link to a specific cell is anywhere close to where this chart is I'm gonna click in a cell maybe just the cell above it in column A I'm gonna right click scroll down to this bottom action view more cell actions there is going to be an option that says get link to this cell so that's what I'm going to do and as soon as you click on that it says link copied to the clipboard so now I'm going to scroll back up to the top we're going to insert the hyperlink function again and that URL to that specific cell you can see it says range A23 is in our clipboard so all I had to do was paste it into this first argument and then I'm gonna give it a label like expense chart click on this and that takes me down directly to that chart we can do the same thing to create a link down here to go back to the top so I'm just going to scroll up to where I want to go. In this case, it'll just be cell A1. I'm going to right click, scroll down here, view more cell actions, get linked to the cell. It says copy to my clipboard. So I'm going to scroll back down here and insert a hyperlink, paste in that cell we just copied to our clipboard just call this back to top and we are back at the top well that is all for now thanks for watching please remember to subscribe